This hack tip is brought to you by Squarespace. Welcome to Hack Tip, the show where we break down concepts, tools, and techniques for hackers, gurus, and IT ninjas. I'm your host, Shannon Morris, and today I'm looking into how to safely and securely delete and restore your files. Now, deleting your files is really easy, right? You just delete something with a flick of the wrist and it goes to your recycle bin. And after a while, you empty the recycling. But that's not all there is to it. Fortunately and unfortunately, there are some really easy tools you can use to restore your deleted files, which is why it's really important to securely delete those files for good. So, here are some great tools for both deleting and restoring your files. To restore files previously deleted from your recycle bin, you can use Restoration or Recuva. First of all is Restoration. Run Restoration as an administrator to search deleted files or even old files on a newly formatted card or drive. This tool is really great in the fact that it's so simple and there isn't a download so you can use it on a flash drive even. Its cons are it's not going to find everything and it doesn't have a vast interface for really, really extensive searches. Next up is Recuva. Recuva also works for restoration and it can do a simple scan or a complex one depending on if your file hasn't been found by previous scans. Although this tool does require a download, it is a lot more advanced with the technical GUI, so it can make searches much easier to dwindle down to just a few results. Very nice. After the break, I'll check out a couple more tools that'll make erasing a file much more secure. Squarespace is the fast and easy way to create any kind of website. With their fully hosted platform and their point and click design controls, you won't need to install anything or know any kind of code to be able to use it. Page modules help you create everything from a blog to a photo gallery by simply adding some articles or pictures and then making your beautiful gallery or slideshow come to life. Squarespace has pre-built templates, 24-hour customer support, and awesome widgets for anything that you need. Plus, if you use our code HAK510, you get a two-week free trial and 10% off. All you have to do is go over to www.squarespace.com HAK5 and enter the code HAK510 to start creating your new website. Now for erasing those blasted files. Hitting delete just removes the references to that file from the file list. The file is still there until some data gets written over it, and even then it's still not completely deleted. So you need a good, good tool to finish off those files completely for good. So first off is Eraser. Eraser works with pretty much any drive on your machine. It's customizable and you can schedule erases. I like that you can choose the Eraser method and you can replace files with new files to allow plausible deniability. <laughs> That's cute. And my last choice is sdelete. This command line tool uses the Department of Defense standards for securely deleting files. Being a simple command line tool, sdelete doesn't take up any space and it runs without issue on pretty much any Windows box. It doesn't have the smooth interface of Eraser, but it is streamlined and it is really simple to use. So, do you have a different one for recovering and deleting files? Send me a note in the comments below or email us at tips at hack5.org. And be sure to check out our sister show, Hack5, for more great stuff just like this. I'll be there, reminding you to trust your Technolest. Yes, start over.